Hey guys, welcome back to another one. This is Crypto Elite and this is going to be another update to my Theta staking earnings. So every month I go over this. I think it's pretty good so people get a idea of what I am doing as well as what they can potentially earn. So in last month, I talked about my Theta staking earnings and T-Fuel and I've also started to incorporate T-Fuel, T-Drop, T-Bill and Bullet as well. So we'll dive into that a little bit later in the video and I actually have been pretty impressed about uh, actually tracking this but let's start off with my earnings from november as you know or if you're unfamiliar i've invested about eight thousand five hundred dollar in the theta ecosystem about five thousand averaging into theta and about three thousand five hundred averaging into t fuel and this all happened uh, more or less two years ago and the prices were a lot higher as you can imagine so without further delay let's get into it how much i have earned this month is 168 which is a lot higher than previous months when i was just earning about 60 to 70 so i'm actually pretty happy to see that number and i am utilizing gpool services no this is is not sponsored content this is just something that i'm using because it's a lot easier for me rather than having to run my laptop 24 7 and that brings my total t fuel earnings to about 1356 once again not too bad at the peak of the bull market last cycle it would be a lot higher of uh, earnings, which we'll talk about uh, here in a second. But because we're not in that bull cycle, let's check out the price of Theta it was about 95 cents. And if we go to coinmarketcap.com near the end of November, you can see it was approximately 95 cents when we ended uh, the month of November. And that's kind of how I'm counting things. And for T Fuel, the end of November was about four cents, almost five cents. And once again, if we go to Coin Market Cap that com coinmarketcap.com we can see once again that we ended the month right around uh, four cents almost five cents so that is the numbers that i'm going to be utilizing for the spreadsheet numbers of transactions it doesn't matter as much now that i'm using gpool services it's a lot more transactions 618 than when i was running my personal laptop i just had 16 to 15 uh, transactions per month so they're using a different algorithm and a different payout method uh, so that is what that number is based off of so the monthly usd earned is about eight dollars a little over eight dollars so not gonna uh, be a millionaire anytime soon with uh, those kind of monthly usd earns but once again this is just passive income working in the background and i don't have to do very much for it which is pretty nice it would be nice if i started averaging in right about now instead of uh when it was the the bull cycle starting to cool down that monthly earn would make a lot more sense with the total amount invested and that is just based off of the t fuel price at the end of november is what i'm basing that off of and my uh, monthly t fuel earn so laptop energy as i said i'm using g pool services so this is zero dollars for now but that is a factor for decentralization and other people using their laptop 24 7 or computer 24 7 to mine if you will or run a node so the total usd earn and this is from the start is about 65 dollars and 13 cents and once again that is based off of this price of t-fuel right now or at the end of november so that is something that i started looking at in the past which kind of drove me over here to start looking at other use cases in the theta ecosystem and that's why i have the t fuel t drop t bill and bullet so if i were to instead of just leaving everything in t fuel which i haven't i have actually used this t fuel to purchase nfts and other things but hypothetically speaking if i were to just leave it in t fuel that's how much i would earn throughout the entire time of me tracking this um so I'll just kind of leave that there for now. The return on asset for Theta and T-Fuel, as we know, is not very good at all. It's about 80% down, almost 90% for T-Fuel. So like I said, if I were to average in now or continue averaging in, this would lower that return on asset or make it a little bit better as a uh, way to look at it. Um, but as of right now, I have not continued to average in, at least in this portfolio that I'm tracking. So that is why those numbers look bad and they're going to continue looking bad until the next bull cycle. Unfortunately, my return on investment likewise is not very good. 
for the s p 500 or something big like that you would expect to see eight to nine percent maybe even ten percent per year on average and right now my average is pretty weak and once again that's just because eight thousand five hundred dollars is what i invested all together as the vehicle is what i'm looking at and it's a lot less than that right now um so that is the return on investment and then the apy the average once again not super duper pretty uh, about two percent uh two percent is not exactly what you want to see when you invest that much money you want to see like i said a lot more so that is the overall number for the theta ecosystem right now let's hop on over to some of the other parts of the theta ecosystem so one thing i didn't i just recently added and i started this back in august and then september i forgot to track it but october i started tracking it again uh, i forgot to change the change the, the delta amount from uh, the beginning to each month i'm going to track how much the price has gone up and down so that is something that i will do so it looks like from the beginning to October, the price of everything went down except for T-Fuel. Actually, that went up. So once again, from uh, October to November, let's check it out. Once again, it's T-Fuel, T-Drop, uh, Bullet, and um, T-Bill. So I will just make all of these black at the same time so the total amount leaving of uh, october i had 12 dollars in t fuel it went down to nine dollars so the bear market is still in effect t drop i had eleven dollars now i have nine dollars so very very similar very comparable um decrease in amount t bill on the other hand i had ten dollars and i went down to six dollars and then bullet was at 11 bucks and then that jumped down quite substantially which is very interesting because it's not a very liquid token right now but it did jump down quite substantially so we are in the red the entire month for everything it looks like bullet or excuse me, T-Bill is the winner in the worst case. Uh, they went down the most, 33% from the last month, which is pretty insane. And I'm also kind of interesting, I am looking at the numbers of tokens because I started when we're checking out um, T-Bill, I had five T-Bill and about 100 fuel in order to enter the liquidity pool and every single month i just keep getting less and less of each token so that is the way that the t bill uh ecosystem and liquidity pool works right now as the crypto market stays in the bear market and the prices go down i think we're going to continue to get less and less it, it'll just keep pulling that uh crypto out of the wallet but on the flip side i think whenever the bull cycle comes i should start to get more and more t-bill and t-fuel back into it so i will keep an eye on that if you're interested i think this is a pretty good use case not a lot of people actually show their earnings so this is something that you can follow along and track as well so I do want to leave you with that crypto market being very turbulent right now. If you're interested in following along on my trades, because I am purchasing crypto every single day, actually. And I have a Patreon where you can follow along with my trades if you are interested. Link is in the description below. Thanks for following along on this update, and I will see you on the next one.